Hi everyone. Today I want to talk about five easy to do interior improvements to help get your home sold for top dollar. Now, while curb appeal draws buyers into your home, having appealing interiors will sell your home. And you don't have to spend tens of thousands of dollars on your house prior to putting it up for sale. On the contrary, the little things you do generally give you the biggest increase in value. So concentrate on the three C's, clean up, clear out, and cosmetic improvements. Tip one, clean, scrub, and polish. Make sure your stove, oven, refrigerator, microwave, any other appliances, they gotta be spotless inside and out. In addition, make sure your walls, floors, bathtubs, shower sinks sparkle. Whether you do the work or hire someone, make sure your house is spotless. Tip two, eliminate odors. Buyers will notice strong smells as soon as they walk through your front door, so eliminate them now. Smoke and mildew, pet odors, they can leave buyers with a bad impression. Think about cleaning drapes and carpets to help get rid of some of those odors. Remove ashes from the fireplace. Use air fresheners or candles to keep your home odor free. Tip three, fix faucets and leaky toilets. If any of your sinks or bathtubs drain slowly, make funny noises, or unclog them and fix them, any buyer who makes an offer will most certainly have a home inspection afterward. So take care of it now before it becomes more of a problem. Tip four and most important, get rid of clutter. Clutter is a seller's enemy. So keep clutter off your kitchen counters, dirty dishes out of the sink, eliminating clutter and excess furniture makes a uh, rooms appear larger. And we want prospective buyers to be able to envision their furniture in your home. So sell it, store it, or give it away. Recycle those old stacks of uh, magazines and newspapers you've been saving for no good reason. Dump all that junk you've accumulated over the years in the attic and basement. And last but not least, clean, organized closets, bookcases, and drawers. Tip five, make cosmetic improvements. Painting isn't expensive, especially if you do it yourself. But be careful when selecting interior colors. Avoid bright, bold colors with strong visual impact. You may love the effect, but remember, you're not the buyer. So stick to conventional whites, pastels, and neutral colors that won't clash with most buyers taste. And remember, before you paint, be sure to patch any nail holes, cracks, or dings in walls. I hope these tips have been helpful. And remember, contact me anytime for all your real estate needs or community information. Should you need to sell your home before you buy your next one, let's talk. And thanks for watching.